temperatures are very comfortable for this time of year as they are quite seasonable and near normal. Current temperatures right now 40 in Lima, 37 in Van Wert, 39 in Paulding, 38 in Salina, 41 to the northeast in Finley. Looking at satellite and radar, unfortunately, these clouds are just quite stubborn across the area and it's just extending our glooming stretch of weather that we've been having over the next over the past week. And as we zoom out to the Pacific West, we are tracking this next vigorous trough that is just beginning to move on shore to California. That will move eastward and be a big weather maker for the entire country really over the next seven days. So let's track this out with our jet stream and upper level wind. So we see this big trough over the western United States. It ejects into the plains on Tuesday as it does so an area of low pressure develops in the central Great Plains by Wednesday and Thursday. That's when the forcing and moisture arrives to our our neck of the woods and provide us chances for rain by Friday colder air arrives as a trough is now over us and any precipitation by then will be in the form of snow showers and that low system will also bring some much colder air into the area. So for the next few days, we're going to have southwest winds bringing milder air ahead of this system. But as we go past, especially by Friday and beyond in the next weekend, we have a lot of cold air spilling southward from Canada as that gates of cold air have really opened up. And really, I see this cold air staying with us for quite some time. So 6 to 10 day temperature outlook. So this is December 17th through the 21st. Nearly every Everyone in the country likely have below normal temperatures for the 8 to 14 day outlook. Our odds increase even more and this is going all the way through Christmas. So early indications show that Christmas could be on the colder side this year. So looking at Skycast, we have those stubborn clouds remaining. Can't rule out an area drizzle or two. Temperatures will drop into the lower 30s overnight. Going into our Monday, upper 30s to right around 40 will be the rule. Zooming out to look at this area of low pressure, this thing really gets going to morning blizzard across the northern plains severe weather across the southern plains and as this area low pressure moves it's going to crawl across the central plains but by wednesday morning right around sunrise rain will likely arrive here we could see a weakening in that rain by wednesday afternoon wednesday evening but by thursday morning another round of rain looks likely as this storm system will be quite intense looking at the seven day forecast clouds increase for our tuesday 43 rain likely wednesday 45 with a.m. rain likely Thursday morning high of 48 and by Friday we really begin to cool down 36 with a chance of snow showers by Saturday and Sunday temperatures will be below freezing a few snow showers possible Saturday and that cold air will likely stay and will likely have many days in a row of below freezing temperatures by into two weeks. Sartage.